Good morning again. Here we are at 2132 Circle. So, neighbor's house, beautiful cottonwood tree, lots of shade. So this is an older part of Cove. Um, and, but it's really, you know, especially down here. So we're kind of at the end of the street. Um, really nice little area. House is on pier and beam. Um, we've got a little bit of cracking, but it's not going through the brick. It's just going through the mortar, but it does have some separation. So I'm going to look inside and see if that is anything. So let's go on in. All right. So this one does have the original hardwood floors. You can tell they've been stained over do kind of need a little bit more love to them um, been scratched new paint job does not smell like animals at all um it looks like yeah we may have some foundation i don't know if you can see what i'm seeing but they've repaired a crack and not very well um, that went all the way to the floor and that is not where the separation is but we've got yeah we just got where they've repaired some cracking I'm not feeling anything like as I'm walking I've got a crack above the door going that way um, and this may have just been a drywall patch that went horribly wrong, but I think they were trying to cover up the cracking. Um, floors feel pretty good. Let me go over here. Yeah, they feel really pretty solid. Um, okay, so let's go into the kitchen. So this is the kitchen dining area that, I don't know where the last switch is. Kitchen dining. So open space, um, original cabinets. You can see that they cut out a place for a microwave, but then they installed a microwave. So that's kind of weird. Not a lot of space. They installed the dishwasher next to this thing. That's kind of, it's just kind of odd spacing. Um, sink looks good. Uh, Doesn't look like they got lock boxes underneath the sink. Not sure what that's about. Looks like there was a hole here. Yeah, because this is soft. Um, I don't know if you can see me pushing on it. So they tried to patch up a hole. Um, I don't even remember how much this one is. Still love the hardwood floors. So you got a little bath. It's actually pretty good room in here. Oh, even has a closet, but pretty good room. Oh, I love the houses that have the original hardwood floors. Once again, this is another bedroom. Oh, and it's got a walk-in closet. Um, looking around the windows. Not seeing any cracking, so that's good. HVAC unit. Oh, that looks pretty new. Um, I don't know why all of them can't put the year on it. Made in Mexico. Um, but I don't see the year. But it doesn't look old. Or it doesn't look too old. Okay, and it is a gas unit. Um, so that means there is gas to the house. We may be able to put in a gas cooktop. Once again, nice size closet. That's your access to this is a pure and beam house. So that's your access to underneath the house. Bedroom's a little smaller. All right, so here's the master. Um, it's kind of a smaller area too. Now this one was just a three bedroom, one bath house. So, I'm not sure how you feel about that. So you've got 
just three bedrooms. And honestly, I think this first bedroom is a bigger bedroom. But it's just a three bedroom, one bath. Go and look out the garage. So here we got stairs down. Oh, lots of storage space. There's your washer and dryer area there. Um, garage door opener. Another attic access or attic access. So you have two doors to the outside. Because <laughs> this door goes into the kitchen, which is kind of weird. Where your washer goes, they put new connections in for the washer, dryer, coming directly off the electric panel. Electric panel looks good. That's where it comes directly off of that. All right, let's check out backyard. Ooh. Okay, no patio. Um, it's got aluminum siding, HVAC unit, you got a storage building, but just an underwhelming backyard. Look out at the storage building. Used to be a tree. Storage building has a lock on it. I think I can get in there. So anyway, uh, concerned about the roof. We've got some tile or some shingle issues on the roof. A little concerned there. Let's see. All right. Nice big storage building. Oh, a lot of water damage. So maybe not as nice, but it is a big storage building. So I'm not sure. Oh yeah, you can see right there where it's like caved in. So storage building's a wash, no value there. Um, everybody looks like they take good care of their property. Do you have a clothesline if you need? Had a sidewalk at one time. The aluminum siding doesn't look bad at all. Mm. Honestly, not as excited about this one. I got to step down. Um, so just like, but the garage doors are new. Oh, good. And you have an air vent in here. That's kind of weird. So it just like that's kind of been the issue. 